Hello and welcome to Beam Add-in Revit Tutorials. In this tutorial, I would like to show you how to make very interesting presentations of facades and sections in Revit in a very simple way. I will show you how to add view depth, how to add photo background, shadows, and so on. However, in addition to all that, perhaps the most interesting thing will be how to add silhouettes of birds using text. I will share the text font with bird silhouettes in the description and comments of this tutorial. I will also share a link with uh, the photo I used for the background uh, on the facades, on the section and facade use. I also want to mention that this is just one of the methods to push your limits of using Revit. For this tutorial we will use the consistent colors visual style. The reason is that the colors on plant families can only be changed when the consistent visual style is turned on. However, after this tutorial, I will, I will make a tutorial on how to use other visual styles, especially how to make a presentation combining different visual styles. For example, combining hidden line and realistic visual style. But about that in uh, some other tutorial, now we will go on, on uh, making presentation of our frontal view using uh, consistent visual style. Uh, I opened graphic display options and I will add uh, shadows. Here it is, we have our shadows. Now I will show you how to add uh, view depth. By changing these values manually or by write, writing the numbers in the uh, in this place here you can you can change the view depth and now i will show you how to add background photo this is the background photo i will add it to the comments and description of this tutorial and you can use it if you like here you can change the background photo okay that's it. Okay. Uh, I think we need to move this photo uh, a little bit up. All right. Graphic display. Okay, uh, from here you can move the uh, background photo uh, right, left and uh, down or up. We will move it a little bit more. I want the white texture of the background photo to be visible. Okay, I think this is enough and now I will show you how to change the colors of the uh, uh, tree plants families that we have here. As I said before, we're using a, a consistent uh, visual style, consistent colors visual style, be because we uh, can change the colors of trees only if this style is turned on. For example, in hidden line uh, visual style, we can do the changes. Now I will add the materials different different type of materials for the uh, plants families and i will uh, add the colors uh, in this part here 
because changing uh, colors uh, here, uh, the changes are going to be visible in a consistent color uh, visual style. Okay. Now I will speed up a little bit uh, the, this tutorial because I will repeat the same steps for edit, uh, editing the colors. We will have different types of uh, plants and we will add different colors. So the steps are going to be same. Okay. Uh, just to repeat, we will use uh, for this presentation, we will use for creating this presentation of use and sections, we will use consistent colors uh, visual style because uh, uh, families of, of plants uh, can be modified only in this, in this visual style or the colors can be visible, the changes uh, we made uh, with colors can be visible only in this visual style. Okay, we have a few uh, plants left. The steps are, I will repeat the same steps. Okay, and in this part here we will change the color. Uh, so the color will be visible in the in the color in the consistent uh, colors visual style. You can uh, I, I in this tutorial I will show you only the principle how this uh, presentation of use works. You can add the colors you like. You can change the colors you the way in the way you like it. Or you can create something totally different. You can create your own, your own uh, uh, way of presentations. Okay, we will add, we will add one more. All right, here we will change the colors. And this is new color. Okay, we are have few more and I will show you how to add, uh, how to add uh, bird silhouettes using text. Okay, that's it. And now I will uh, now using override graphics. I will change the projection lines. I will change the projection lines colors in this way. Uh, the same steps uh, will re be repeated for others, for other plants families. And after this, I will show you how to add uh, silhouettes of birds using text. That that was uh, very surprising. Discover discover I I did uh, searching uh, how to improve uh, the presentation of views and sections. Because using text, the text don't. Uh, take um, too much place like families and don't make uh, uh, computer slower so it's very good now I will change the, uh, the colors of this tree of lines of this tree okay All right. 
Right. Uh, that's it and now I will show you how to add uh, these bird silhouettes okay now we will create a new text okay for example I will write different letters here and now we will uh, change the name and the text font we will change birds you can find this uh, text font in the text and description of these tutorials now you you see here we have a lot of uh, birds now I will delete the necessary ones and for example we uh, just just to mention uh, changing the the letter size if you want small if you write small letters the birds uh, will fly in one way if you write uh, the large letters the uh, birds will fly in other way left or right small letters for left big letters for right also you can change here you can you see color of the uh, of the uh, text and you can make these birds in different colors for example you can make them green I will left uh, them in black but if you like you can make them green or on a, some other color okay now we will add here one more group of birds All right. We will create a different type of text and make these birds look smaller. Uh, in this way, we we see them uh, far. <laughs> Okay, it looks it looks like they are far from uh, this tree I created before. Okay, and that's it for this tutorial. I, this is one very simple way to create uh, different types of uh, presentations and please don't forget to subscribe and share my tutorials till the next tutorial in next tutorial i will show you how to use different visual styles like like hidden lines and i also i will show you how to combine uh, different visual sty styles for example hidden line visual style with uh, realistic visual style uh, for example, uh, we can make uh, topography and plants uh, with with uh, sky in hidden line visual style, and our uh, ho our house can be in realistic visual style. I will show you that in next tutorial. That's all for this tutorial, and till the next one.